Right, back here again. Here comes Andre's pals, who I'm never gonna kill because the controls are shit. My opinion is my opinion. My opinion is also final, so... I'm supremely pissed off that I died though, I really am. Because I it was seriously going to be a no death run. It was. I was seconds away. Well, I say seconds. About an hour or so, from, well, maybe not an hour. But you know what I mean, I was there. I was there, I was. I had a, de a no death run coming my way. Pretty much. And now I'm going to die again, because I seriously can't kill these things. I swear they have, their, they have more defense than before as well. be no more of these sections otherwise I'm screwed especially when I have no health or at least little to no health I remember there being another set yeah this is what I remember I was gonna say I remember there being another section Oh shit. This is it, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure that's it, right? Right. Yes, good. Good. That's a very annoying noise. A very annoying noise. I just hope I have enough points. 40,000, is it enough? I hope so. You can get more points here if it's not, but it should be enough. Oh! No, that's not it. Oh, there we go. Right. Moment of truth. I'm going to be pissed off. This doesn't work. Ooh, guess who's pissed off? Tears, that's who. If this isn't enough now, I'm going to be very annoyed. What do you mean it's not enough? That's an odd glitch. But what do you mean it's not enough? Do you have to get it for this one as well? Because I swear last time I didn't. In fact, last time I definitely didn't. I didn't get the points for it last time, and I still had the fucking Zala secret open up for me. Ooh, guess who's fucking pissed off more? <laughs> it's Teal. I'm genuinely tempted 
to take footage from my previous Let's Play because fuck this game. I can't be fucked to play it. I really can't. Fuck this fucking cunting game. Fuck it, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it! Because what's the point? It's not gonna work. The port is shit. I've seen one get seen someone get into that Zal Secret with 39,000 on this level. So why can I, with 40,000 something fucking hundred, I couldn't get it? I wonder. <laughs> the port is shit. That's why. Lava's fucked. The levels aren't the same. Music's removed. Where's the fucking Rayman thing, which is awesome? With how to defeat Rayman? Uh, what else is missing uh, that I like? Oh, the controls on the uh, ship don't feel right. Uh, the list goes on. Let's put it that way. I don't know why, but this port is just. It's not a waste of money. If you don't own the game, get the game. But, in comparison, if you have a PS2 and you can find it cheaper on the PS2, get the PS2 version. So much better. If I find out they've ruined some of the games on this thing, I swear to God. So if they have ruined one of the, some of the games, I'll be so annoyed. Anyway, this is Reflex. He's uh, fairly easy. In with blue, power up, then red. Yet again, he's the only canon you can hit because what the fuck? I don't know. Oh, another thing with the ports, sprite limitations, which definitely didn't occur in the PS2 version. Yes, that's another one. There are definitely sprite limitations in this section of the game, well, not in like the late half of the game. I don't know why, because it wasn't in the PS2 version. I don't hate this port. But I hate this port in every way, because it's really annoying in comparison. I don't know what it is. It's maybe I have a strong emotional attachment to the other one. It's probably something to do with that. But I don't know. I just I don't like this version. Why can't someone create a port where there is little to no change whatsoever? Is it possible? Is it actually possible? Is it actually possible to create a port with no changes at all? Just none. Don't, don't change anything. So it's a fair question. Because I mean, because they've done it. They, they, it can't be that hard. They've changed the game too much. They in fact ruined part of the best thing from the game. And why? What for? Didn't make it, it certainly didn't make it better. The section also feels laggy. I don't know why. Rayman's movement sort of stutters. If that makes sense. Like I'm moving, then it sort of stops, and then I move again. At least it feels like that. I don't know. Too late for that. I'll finish him next time. Hit me! Thanks for the boost.
I do know how to jump, it's just you're doing it quite quickly. This is definitely lagged. Something's lagging. That move that flying movement is incredibly lagged. I don't know what has happened. Kill him, kill him, kill him. Thank Christ. Right. And there's a secret here. Don't know this if this will last. Nah, it's too far away. Worth a try. Yep, there you go. Secret. And sprite limitations prevail again. What the hell? I don't know why there were so many glitches in this port. Yeah, there were the fair share of glitches in the previous one, but they were ones I didn't mind because they weren't destroying my faith in the company that actually made me love this game originally. Like, this cut, this, this boss shouldn't have spot limitations. This boss's spot limitations is broken because I won't know where to go because the whole concept of it Yes, I know where to go, because I can see where the cans are going to be. That's the point of it. If the cans are gone, then I'm screwed. At least partially. I'm not looking forward to this... point precisely. That went well, didn't it? What the hell? Almost didn't see that there. Oh, I wonder why sprite limitations. It's funny, isn't it? No, not that word. Not funny. The other one. Not funny. Sad. Thank you, game. What the fuck? This is fair. Kill him. Yeah, that's never good. Rayman, it's me. Come on, hop on. We're headed for the Tetris. Andre's gotta be there. I better fucking be ready for these controls. Let's hope so. Oh yeah, I forgot I have to I have to press it myself, don't I? Let's 
basically you get him twice like this the scepter and then he will charge and that's when you get him the final time that's how it works charging time good I have decided, um, I was playing this, I don't want to play this for a while, because it's really annoying, so, and by really annoying, I mean like when I get back from Germany, I want to just do Jack and Baxter and Toy Story Racer, because this game right now is pissing me off, <laughs> I mean supremely, in a way that it shouldn't have, but it's gotten to the point where I'm seriously starting to realise how much they They've ruined it. They really have. They've ruined one of my favourite games ever made. And it's sad. It's funny, I'm going to die here. I'm not going to die here. I know I'm not. I'm going to be perfectly fine here. And I know I will. I know I'm not going to die here because I'm just not. Which means my my death was caused by a section which shouldn't have been as hard as it was. Because I've never had problem with it, ever. Especially not with full health. But they've ruined the controls. I don't... Oh, I should love this port. I just don't. I hate it. It's sad. It really is. Of course that happened. Of course it does. Because you can't aim with this thing. That's the problem. You can't aim. There's no aim button. It either goes to the top or it goes to the bottom. You need luck within the middle. So yeah, I'm not going to do any of the bonus stuff, or, this, or playing through Rayman 3 on my PS2 version, until I get back, because... Oh, this, I know it's like a month away, I couldn't care less. Okay, it's not a month away, but even so, I couldn't care less. I just couldn't. I just realised this is a techno version of um, the battle against reflux. Interesting. Of the first battle against him. Wow, how have I never realised that? It is! It definitely is! It's a remix of the um, first battle against him. Definitely. Amazing.
Right. One left. One more phase, I believe. The end. I'll kick your ass. You've hit me a few times, but I'm going to finish this right now. You're attacking me with red lumps, I hope you know that. Four, four, six, six, six. If I die now, I swear to God. I genuinely do. I'm just quitting. Gonna rage quit. I totally hit him. Thank Christ. Thank Christ. I'm scared. No. Ninety percent. No, not bad. I can live with that. sleep after all hey what's the matter glow box it's Andy I miss him you know he's happier now look at the red lumps how happy they seem I don't care I want my Andy I'm not sure that's such a good idea besides I wouldn't know how to do it you have to scare a red lump Ooh, I hate to imagine what could Possibly scare a lung. Yay! There we go. Oh, I beat the game. Now, what was patience paid off for? <laughs> what trophy was that? I just want to check this out for a second. Watch the real ending. Yeah, I don't know what the other ending is. <laughs> I only know one ending, that one. So what's what would you mean watch the real ending? Oh well. Right, my verdict. Do I hate this port? Yes and no. Do I hate the game? No. Do I hate this game because of the gameplay? No. I hate this port. Uh, do I hate this port because of the gameplay? Sorry. No. I hate this port because it's 
too different from what I love and I think it's one of those things where I have a strong love for the PS2 version apart from it being one of my favorite PS2 games of my childhood it was the first game I let's play granted my let's play wasn't great because I was a kid I had a high-pitched voice the quality was shit etc that's not the point the point is I have a very strong emotional attachment to this game and it's sort of like the game has just said a f massive fuck you to me I think the best way to describe it is the thing you hold precious and dear if it changed would you like it as much and I don't mean in terms of people because people change but I mean it's something you you might like it a better way. If you know what I mean? If, if a game changes in, from what you used to love, and. It's, okay, say so you play a game from your childhood from, say, 10 years ago. Doesn't matter what it is. You haven't played it in ages, and you pick up another version of it. A new version, a port. And you haven't played it in 10 years, you're really looking excited. You really feel excited to play it. And you remember all the feelings you had, you remember every core aspect of the gameplay, even though it's been 10 years, because that's how much the game meant to you. And it's not right. There's things that are different, there's things that's changed. That's what... It's the only way I can really describe it. And it's... It's not a bad port for probably anyone else in the world, with the exception of one or two people who don't like the game or whatever. But... It, it's just bad for me. If that makes sense. I don't know if it does. I hope it does. But that's why I don't like this port. My recommendation if you have a PS2 or a PS Vita can play a PS2 games and you find it online cheaper, get it. Because the trophies, let's be honest, aren't great. It's not worth it for the trophies. The trophies are shit, let's be honest here. You don't even get a platinum for getting them all, that's really dumb. I mean, Jack and Dax, they give you loads of trophies, but that's not a problem. I mean, they give it to you at reasonable times, like for certain missions and then for certain stuff. Some people could argue that it's overload, well, this is not overload, it's the exact opposite. Oh yes, the intro I was talking about. The one with um, the Madder song. Um, I've decided not to show that. The reason is I imagine they couldn't get the copyright for that song on the port. And I don't want to upload it at the risk of getting a copyright strike. So you can watch the intro somewhere else. At least this music's amazing in every way. Now I could very easily um, do the mini games now, and it would probably only take about an hour to do the rest of the stuff. But I'm just not feeling up to it at all. I'm not depressed or anything. I'm just ugh, this game. I'm mildly sick of this game. I won't be in about a year. In a year, I won't let's play it. I don't think I'll ever let's play this again. At least, I don't imagine. I might stream it one time, but I probably won't ever let's play it. It's very unlikely. The only way I'll let's play this again is if I get a ridiculous amount of subscribers who have like probably never played it. Or want to remember it? That's probably the only time. Like, and by loads, I mean like the fifty thousand mark. So a good few years, I imagine. Murphy was Billy West, really? Hmm. Matter by Groove Armada. Ha, <laughs> that's funny, because it wasn't there.
I'm tired now for some reason. Right. So I think I'm going to look at the mini games, not actually play them, just look at assume it look and see if they're the same ones. Because I assume they should be. These credits are quite long. Reddits are over. Woo! At least I think they are. Yeah, they are. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> Bonus. Yeah, okay. Yeah, they're all the same. Hmm. That one. Oh, well. Yep, they really did get rid of the How to Defeat Rayman. That genuinely surprises me. That really does. Oh well. Meh. Nah. Disappointments. Massive disappointments. <laughs> 